On today's episode of Mummy's Boy, we discuss Mum's first ever TikTok. The new viral baby soothing craze. And I reveal my dream pub name. Remember to like and subscribe so you never miss an episode. It's Mummy's Boy. Hello. <laughs> And welcome to Mummy's Boy with me, Arthur Hill, and my adorable and preposterous mother, Lisa. How very... Say hello, Mum. No, how very dare you. Preposterous. Preposterous. Very... Preposterous. Preposterous. Deep down, I've always been a Mummy's Boy at heart. And in this weekly podcast, I get to spend some quality time with Mum and receive some much-needed advice that only a mother can give. Oh, yes. But sometimes my mum needs help too. TikTok viral videos, celebrities. These are all things which my poor mum just can't get her head around. So I'm here to help her before this modern world leaves her behind. Not only will I help her unravel the mysteries of youth and bring her into the digital age, but I'll also be making Lisa's motherly wisdom available to all of you as well. Bravo! So if you are in need of advice or even just have a question or story that you are desperate for Arthur's mum to read slide into our dms on socials at mummy's boy pod or send us a message or even a voice note to whatsapp on 07822 013837 you said it weird i said uh, it differently no, you did just to mix things up yeah, a bit did it throw you yeah it did massively yeah, in. Soz. and no matter what the issue i will ask when a feature i like to call mum can we talk oh let Welcome Karen, back. Thank you so much. Now, I will say, um, after my comments last week about your colour choices, oh. I like them this week. Do you? I felt they clashed slightly last week. Well, yeah, they did But a bit. this blue, nice with blue. That, pink, that pink, my God. That's fabulous. You, look, you don't look a day over 40. Thank you, Trump. Times two. That's um, <laughs> Yes, no. <laughs> you look beautiful. Very beautiful. Thank you. What's going on with him? Thank Do you know, you. is he is he going to win? Oh. oh, please don't even get me Hey, Jack, started. can you pull up the uh, election results? Sorry, oh, yeah. we got, we got a new TV. <laughs> it's very um, exciting. Yeah. Um, yeah, uh, I can't, let's not. You, <laughs> I think I've seen you, or maybe we spoke about this already, that whole, where Joe Biden was like, um, four more years, pause. <laughs> Did you see that? No. <laughs> so far, he's like doing oh this huge God. speech. And apparently, he like nailed the speech and then was like reading the teleprompter and was like, four more years, pause. Oh, no. And then went and just shot, shook an imaginary person's hand. <laughs> <laughs> Their oh, options are truly dire. They are um, really, really mm. dire. Yeah. But you can't have a convicted felon as, as the president, surely. <sighs> And, you know, I, I miss him in a way. No, I miss him you've said in, this before, it was such can you not? Entertainment. No, you know, Every day he's I'd not, wake up on evil... Twitter and he'd say something funny. No, but he's not funny. <laughs> and no one really, you know, didn't do it that, that much wrong, did he? Yes, he really did. Um, so. Yeah, can, well, we'll see. Mm, yeah. Um, wow, oh, this gum is making my head feel fuzzy. Is it? Um, I mentioned it last week. <laughs> I'm just trying to... <laughs> just, this is not an ad. <laughs> I know, I was going to say, are you, are you no, after some I've, sort of a deal? No, but basically the... Because I don't think that I've mentioned it properly, but the, the I'm sick of being abused about my yawning oh. and my burping on well, this podcast. Sorry, because normally I eat right before. Um, yes. Well, I will admit I've only had half a sausage roll today, but I found about found out about this gum that apparently beats the afternoon crash, mm. but it's currently making the left side of my forehead feel like I'm a hedgehog. So I don't really what? know if this, uh, am I having a what? stroke? I don't know. Um, can anyone smell toast? Um, what is the matter I don't with know. you? Oh dear. Could oh, this be the this key? Really Maybe this is all we needed. Well. Just a little bit more energy from Arthur and this podcast is going to skyrocket. Yeah, is that what we need? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I've been trying. Oh! I've been trying, no. Arthur. <laughs> um, oh, what dear. else has been, what's going on with you? Oh God, I'm really worried about yeah. you now. You look a little bit kind of... Arthur, I want some. Oh, what will it do to me? Yeah, it makes you feel like a hedgehog. I shall feel like a. I do think we should do porcupine. like a porcupine. Yes, there the female are. hedgehog. Hey, 
little oh, female yeah. hedgehogs. Yeah, wow. Well, that's Aren't why they? couldn't you be a hedgehog as well? Because I want to um, be even bigger. And I, I, I think you and I should go to Amsterdam as a mummy's boy special and do, <laughs> and do things. <laughs> Sorry? Like what exactly? Just do things in Amsterdam. In Amsterdam. That's what it would be called, the YouTube video. Just do I things. I took my mum to Amsterdam and did things. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure what I think Have about that. Have you been that. there? I've I wouldn't not been want there. to go to a sex club. No. No, me neither. Oh, okay. That's all right then. But there's many other things. We, I meant Are cycling there other things to do? Oh, okay. Oh, right. Mm. Yes, cycling and diamond places and tulips. Is that a thing? Diamond? Yeah, the, diamond. isn't there a diamond quarter or something? Oh. Sex museum? The se we could go to I the sex museum. I don't want to go museum. to the sex museum either. Yeah. Do I? I don't know. Well, it'll, we'll, 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 well get there. Okay. We'll get there. Yeah. We'll see. Cycling um, tulips. But lots yeah. has happened. I feel like we've come a long way since our first episode. Well, we because have. You, have, you, have, you are posting on, you've posted a TikTok. <laughs> um, oh dear. Yeah. Yes. Through oh. our, si my, our sister, my sister. Yes. <laughs> our sister. Uh, uh, yeah. yes. My, my sister, Charlotte. Yes. God bless Who's also her. trying to be an influencer now. Don't know what's going on there. Oh. I did call her out on this. Did you? Charlotte, it's my thing. Okay? Oh, no, you No, I'm can't... joking. No, she just tried. She's making a sourdough. Oh, my God, the sourdough. did a five-part story talking to the camera. Oh, Charlotte, I love her. keep it snappier. Okay? <laughs> I got really bored. That's because no, you're not into, into baking. No. Um, but she's very excited about her sourdough, which she, yeah. apparently can live forever. It's really freaky that I'm going to have this thing in my fridge. Yeah, I didn't alive. even... I thought, wait, what? It goes in your... And it's actually growing and it lives. It does that. Wait, so it's not like a starter? <laughs> no, you Oh, bug. I thought she was just making like a... <laughs> really? <laughs> no, oh. a sourdough starter. Oh, it's like a, you know, a sourdough no, starter. No, it's not you know, like a, a bit of olive oil or something. No, it's, oh. a, it's... I don't know what you do. I'd never heard of it until just this weekend. But you, you make... It's it's the the beginning of how you make a like sourdough. A sourdough monster. It's it yeah. is a bit like a sourdough monster. Gross. And it lives. Apparently, there there are some that have been alive for like a hundred and thirty. What do we years, mean by alive? I don't understand. Down through the is generations. This like a really complex. That how you make sourdough. It comes from this starter. Well, it's what, an, a be it's thing. given a beating heart. I don't understand. What's no, it given? doesn't have a beating heart. I don't it's know. It's alive enough. I, when I come back alive. home, there's something alive in our fridge. Yes, it will be alive. Wow. We need to deal with the mice first. Yeah, we do. And the, what are they called? The, the slugs? Gliss gliss. And the gliss gliss. And the slugs. Which I've never heard of. Slugs, bloody hideous. Yeah. Gliss, gliss gliss sounds like a You've fantasy. You've never heard of a gliss gliss? A fantasy creature. Have you not? Oh. They're half, they're half, they're, um, half rat, half, half horse. No, they're not, you idiot. They're half. Like cenotaphs in, like, in the attic. Like mouse. Like, <laughs> cenotaphs. Not senators, senators. Oh, senators. Sen centaurs. I'll defend the senators. Senators. Um, centaurs. <laughs> <laughs> um, centaurs. Sen Senator. Oh, I don't know. If you type gliss gliss into uh, Google, it comes up as they are European edible dormouse. Yeah. Wait. So An we could edible eat edible dormouse, but, but you're not allowed to eat them. You have to save them. But and also, we're not in Europe. No. Aren't they aware? No, obviously Brexit not. Brexit means I need Brexit, to put a gliss, Brexit gliss. flag outside Get out. the house. Get out of my attic. Yeah. Like, sorry, we just uh, <laughs> wanted to come over. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and apparently they're really, really cute to look oh, at. Oh, I so. bet they are. Gliss, yeah, and gliss. apparently they are. Because they've got really cute, fluffy they? tails. Gliss, gliss. They don't sound Bl cute in the middle of the night when they're Well, I had them above my head. Lord. That I had, where I, where my old bedroom was in the attic, they literally, because my, my head was this close to the yes. ceiling, I'd hear like, they right are above loud. my head. It's like they were in my brain. Well, it's just that chewing they them, I think. drove me crazy. Yeah. <laughs> um, but can we can we view the, the, the Lisa TikTok? Yep. Let's oh. Go. This is great. This oh, is, do I have honestly, to put my headphones on? This has made me so excited. You have to put your this. headphones on, oh. Arthur. There's a trend going around about chicken wine. Can I just tell you, I have been <laughs> drinking chicken wine for many, many years. <laughs> Catch up, people. See, I mean, great song choice. <laughs> obviously, obviously, obviously. So I don't know did this. That. I wasn't aware of this. So I saw this and I had no you idea. You had no idea what I was on about. I don't know what the chicken wine trend Charlotte is. Charlotte told me that there was a big trend going around on TikTok about chicken wine, 
and I. But just, what do we know? What the trend? Does anyone know? What just the trend that is? it's that it's really really popular. Oh. That, and everyone was chicken wine making and have posts you been, about. Have you actually been drinking? And chicken? I have been drinking chicken yeah. wine for many many years. So and obviously is it made I was by chickens or does it have chicken in it? No, it's just got a picture of a chicken on the front. Oh. Interesting. It's called La Vie Ferme, which I think means the old chicken, but maybe it doesn't. <laughs> It could mean some. Is it the old farm? Well, why has it got a picture of a chicken on it then? Because well, chickens are on. F- chickens are the symbol of a farm most yeah, of the time, I suppose. aren't they? Oh, bugger. <laughs> <laughs> had too much of that wine yes. today. Well, I. Yeah. You looked like I, you'd had a bit of the wine. I had had. I had had <laughs> oh. a bit. Oh, I yeah. see. We'd had a neighbour over for a drink. Dad was away. Oh, I think, you, yes, you said. And we had a neighbour over and we sort of had a bottle of chicken wine and then she went home and we were like oh we haven't got any more alcohol in the house so then then there was a mad scramble into a cupboard and right at the back of the cupboard there was was an old birthday present from my 60th the very last bottle that had been given to me for my 60th of Bollinger (laughs) really expensive champagne and I was like why would I have that (laughs) so that got opened and we had that as well Bloody hell, chicken wine and champagne. Chicken wine and champagne, the girl That's knows my how type to live. Of Sunday. It was a Friday, actually. Oh. Well, well what is, what's next for the Lisa Hill TikTok account? Oh, well, how many followers is, is, are we on? She on? Who? Me? You? Oh, I don't know. Let's make a guess. I had some I'm very funny say, messages she's from like people. 113. I'm oh, no, say. I've got more than that. Bloody 273. Hell. One TikTok, 300 followers. How oh, many no, views? Three, oh, on? I was looking at the Eight. number at the top. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Why have I got a number after my name? That's your username. Is it? You made that. Did I? Yeah. Well, there you are. How pissed. drunk were you? Didn't yeah. know what was happening. 8,000 views. Not bad. Can we look at the comments? Views. Are we able to look at the comments? Oh, God. This that's is so such great. I'm loving this screen. Yes, Mama Hill. Oh, nice. I thought I commented. I'm clearly, uh, maybe I was drunk as well. So proud of Mama Hill. Hashtag goat goals. I adore you, you icon. Did you know about these comments? I can't see them from here. Oh, I've got my glasses. Such a trendsetter. I need setter. different glasses for that bit. Purr. Purr. Purr? Yeah. Yeah, this is, yeah. You well, don't know you don't. about purr, do you? Yeah. No. Purr. Lisa's an OG chicken wine drinker. I do am. You, you see? Yeah. OG. Hang on. What's OG? Opera Ghost. Yeah. No. Original. Oh. Okay. Absolutely iconic behavior. Oh, welcome. And yes, we love chicken wine. You see? And then I have no idea what chicken wine is, but I'm very happy you have made a TikTok, Lisa. Oh. God, there's loads of comments. I Big Slay. Really oh, I did comment. Oh, no. Hang on a minute. Oh, yeah, why you just my, said, oh, no. Why have I not got the top like comment here? What's going on? Because you just said, oh, no, which wasn't very mm. positive and True. encouraging for your poor One old day, mother. Yeah. Somebody yeah. told me I was the most up and coming gay icon which I thought found highly, highly amusing. Really? <laughs> Who said that? I don't know. <laughs> I do look really pissed. I don't know how I shouldn't have done that, should I? Oops. <laughs> Arthur and Charlotte's mum. Look, Charlotte definitely made that bio, didn't she? Oh, bless her. I like her. how Charlotte's in brackets. Yeah, and Charlotte. <laughs> Where she belongs. Oh, love her. My girl. Um, well, but now, how are you going to follow it up? Well, so. that's a very good question. Sh- I, we, Charlotte was thinking... Um, we could do one um, with your John Wayne song mm. of me t- doing some sort of travelling thing. Right. But then I haven't seen her since, and I haven't come up with anything. You haven't seen her? Well, not to have time to do anything. Oh. And then I considered doing it on the train up here today and then realised that I didn't know how to. <laughs> so that was a swift idea that went in one eye and out the oh. other. <laughs> What just out happened? The other. I don't know what. I'm talking but then you about. went really weird immediately <laughs> after that. You went no, one here and that, and you went. <laughs> what am I talking? <laughs> what the? Are you okay? That was <laughs> zero to a hundred in a, in a moment. <laughs> what? Am I? What, you're gonna die or something um, there? Just carry carry on. on. Well, we've got more TikToks. Oh, not that no. you've made, but we thought you'd enjoy oh, this. I will definitely um, enjoy it. Oh no! Maybe influencer baby names. So, um, mm. people in my line of work. Oh right. Obviously, they're free thinkers. You know, pioneers. Uh, they don't <laughs> stick to is the norm. No. Um, and Odd. there's this is a genuine video of uh, 
influencer. I can't. Is this the is this the Mormon one? No. Okay. Is that someone holding a baby? Um, no, I that's sh- a. That, oh no, it is. I, I thought that was a pug. <laughs> I thought that was a dog. You can't say that, um, Arthur. But you can't say they, that. These are, these are their potential names for the, they were thinking of. Right. Let's have a watch for okay. these baby names. Okay. These are some baby names I love, but I didn't use this time around. For reference, our kids have pretty unique names. Our daughter's name is Rumble Honey Smith. Our son's name is Slim Easy Smith. And then we just had little Whimsy Lou. <laughs> so these might be a little out there, a little bit more controversial, but in case someone needs any ideas for their kids. These are some girls' names that I loved. We were almost gonna name her Tank. And then I love the name Bo, as in B O W, as a second name. I also Pink really like fruit names, so I love the name Lemon, Plum, and Clementine. Ugh. Also, really liked Pippin or Pip for short, Dotty or Dot for short, and then Ivy as well, just because that would have almost been my name. And then for boys. Oh. Boys are a little bit trickier to name, in my I opinion, bet. but we had the name Halo on the list. Yeah, of course you did. Also, Do, Mercer, do, and Flick. Do. Do. So, yeah, do. those were some names that we didn't do end up using, flick. Do. but that were still on the list. Do movies. Flick. Wow. What was that? Yeah. <laughs> Whimsy Lou <laughs> No, who? sorry. Utterly ridiculous. Pippin is quite sweet. Pippin, but that's Pippin's just quite, Lord of the Rings. Pippin is quite sweet. It's a Pippin. hobbit. No, it's a, Pippin. Music- it's a musical. No, it's Lord of the Rings. Oh, it's a musical. When, what musical? It's called Pippin. No, but... Uh, I'm sure that Lord of the Rings was written before Pippin. No. I oh, bet I it was. Know, Lord of the Rings was what? Producer like, Jack, look it up. It's by Stephen When did Shores, the age of the elves begin? <laughs> uh, Mordor. I mean, it's a while ago. But Bo... Pippin the musical is from 1972. Oh, Come on. 1972. Tolkien's what, like oh, yeah, Tolkien, 30s? Yeah. yeah, but you wouldn't have known of it until they made the films, would you? No. That's not true. Duh. 1937. There we go. Wow. Okay. Fair enough. Well, that's when The Hobbit was released. Yeah. Pit but what was the other one? Do. Do. Do and flick. Do and flick. And then she came out with some quite the Ivy. Bo. Bo's quite nice. Bo. Bo. I know, but it was Bo, as in B O W, as Bo. in bow and arrow. Bow no, and arrow. I mean, I'm fucking sick. I would name my kids Your Bow twins, and Arrow. Bow and That's Arrow. so cool. <laughs> we nearly we nearly called Charlotte Bow and Primrose, Arrow. and then we realised that then she'd be Primrose Hill. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> Who was that? You had a. And we I did have a weird one, one for you. We had Dexter. Dexter. Yeah. I know. I was Dexter, Dexter or Bertie, wasn't I? Yeah, Bertie's a great. I wouldn't name. have minded Dexter. Dex. You would. Dex. Because my name's not of... nicknameable. That's really always annoyed oh, me. Oh, look, we've been through all this, haven't we? About your nicknames. Dex could have been... It is Arturo. D- Lots of people call you Arturo or Art. You taught someone. Did I? I had a funny name. Oh, my God. Yes, I did. Saffron, Saffron Rice. Rice. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine Bonkers. when I was given the register and I looked down and I'm calling and I go, Saffron Rice. What? <laughs> this poor little child. Yes. Like, really? Awful. Bless her. To, yeah. Poor little child. I can't sausage. get bow and arrow. I think I actually might do bow that. Bow and arrow. Bow should I'd be I'd have to be a certain A-U. level of famous to pull that off. Yeah, like you can't. Chris Martin level of, no, what do you call this kid? Apple. Apple. Bloody silly. Oh, that was the mother one. Plum. Plum. What was she doing? Plum. Tomato? No, you can't call anyone what, tomato. Yeah, what, 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 what was it? Plum? Let's think of some of our Lemon? Own you can't call a child lemon. Can you? <laughs> or plum, actually. Plum. Uh, yeah, plum. Plum? Stop doing that. Oh, no, it no. doesn't work. Um, what? what? Water. Walter is a good name. Water. Oh. <laughs> Water. Aqua. No. Aqua's quite nice. Aqua no. Hill. No. What what rolls well with Hill? Arthur. Arthur Hill. Evian. 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 Hill. Like the water. It's Muddy. It's there. Muddy Hill. Muddy Hill. Muddy's nice. Steep. Steep. <laughs> Mossy. Mossy. Grassy. Treacherous. Yeah. Treacherous Hill. Mm. Treacherous Hill. This does remind hill. me though. I did. I've, I'm obsessed with this idea now. And oh I dear. think it will happen one day. Oh dear. Once I've achieve what I've wanted to achieve in the entertainment industry. Right. I will open a pub oh. that turns into a um, 
a music venue in the evening, oh, perhaps right. in an upstairs room or just yes. in the corner. But the pub will be called the Kick and Snare. The Kick and Snare. Just got a good ring to it. Why? Sorry, I've missed something. Well, no, the just because it sort of sounds snare. like a pub name, but it's actually a drum kit. Oh. Maybe the snare could be spelled oh, with like and snare. The kick. Oh. <laughs> the kick drum. I've lost it now. The kick and snare. Right. But maybe it could be spelt like snare hair. So there's like a rabbit coming out of the drum kit in the logo of the pub. I've thought it through. Oh, have you? Mm. Mm. Dad it's could get in, he could we could brew some local beer. Yes. Hills beer. Hills beer. The nice. yeasty the hills of yeast. Ophelia Dick, that was a good name. Sorry, it just came to me. When Dad was in Australia, <laughs> he met a girl and her surname was Dick and her first name was <laughs> Ophelia. I mean, really. Be sure she wasn't coming on to it. Yeah. Ophelia Dick. Ophelia Dick. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> it's Mummy's boy. Shall we move on to the nation's oh. bloody favourite fucking game? Oh, Arthur, that's rude. Yes, let's. Fuck yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> two lies and a truth. Yes. I can... Two lies. Two and lies a truth. and a truth. Um, the question is for you, Mum. You yes. really need to get this right. You're I in really a fucking, do. Sorry, <laughs> bloody hell. I've been so an absolute sorry. disgrace. You have been a, for yeah, weeks. It's embarrassing now. I know. A new way... Of soothing a crying baby has recently been going viral online. Oh no! But what does it involve? Oh, no. A. Playing "Hit Me, Baby, One More Time" <laughs> by Britney Spears in reverse. A. That kind of stuff. B. Placing a slice of cheese onto a baby's head. <laughs> C. <laughs> dipping a baby's feet into Coca Cola. I, I'm sorry, none of those can be correct. You think you'd know by now, Mum. One of them is every week. Yeah, but seriously, those no, are... No, you're right, those though. Are... That is blo- what is the world coming to? Oh. Baby's feet in Coca-Cola. Cheese <laughs> on a baby's head. Gromit. Britney Spears in reverse. Oh Can no! Can we get that, that up in reverse? Freaked me out completely. <laughs> Join us in part two. Well, we'll find the answer. <laughs> and for your mum, can we talk <laughs> correspondence? We got a party after this. Oh my god! Uh... <laughs> <laughs> huh. Can we have a break now, please? Oh. <laughs> yeah, oh, we need the break. We'll about... go. Join us Let's... in part two, and we we'll find the answer. <laughs> and for your mum, can we talk correspondence? <laughs> Oh God! It's Mummy's boy. Welcome mm. back. Thank you so much. Very I shortly, then. yes, we'll be getting to your mum. Can we talk correspondence? But oh, first, whoopee. before the break, I asked you mm. a new way of soothing a crying baby. Has recently been going viral online. But what does it involve? A playing "Hit Me, Baby, One More Time" by Britney Spears <laughs> in reverse. B placing a slice of cheese onto a baby's head. C, dipping a baby's feet into Coca-Cola. <laughs> um, I, I, cheese. Cheese. B. B. It's cheese. Your final answer is placing a slice yep. of cheese onto a baby's head. Yeah. Well, because, hit me baby one more time, no matter which way, whether it's forwards or backwards, is a very jiggy kind of song, isn't it? Yes, you know. you're right, actually. So that's not going to soothe you, whether it was going the right way or not. Dipping your feet in Coca-Cola, well, then your baby would have wet feet, and you don't want to be lying there with wet feet, do you? Very good. Very good logic here. Logic is Mm. everything. Whereas a nice slice of Gouda on your head as a child, (laughs) as a baby, would probably fit quite nicely, Mm. you know, like a little cap. Mm. It's got to be cheese. It's, uh, it's got to be it's cheese. It's got to be cheese. And the answer is... <laughs> B. No. Yes. It is. It is. It's cheese. It's bloody cheese. Oh, bloody hell. I know. It's cheese, it's Gromit. Cheese. And it's really funny as well. Oh, my God. Oh, so my God. So we've got God, a video I to prove it. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> that was so good. <laughs> Works every time. Oh, that is just... Oh, look at that little face. I bet that baby's probably thinking, how dare he? No! Oh. And I think I was right. I think it is Gouda. No, I think it's like the shitty American cheese. Style cheese, you oh, know. Oh, do you? Well, Sorry, all It Americans. would work even better with Gouda or... I don't know what Gouda Emmental is, to be honest. or something. I don't even know my cheese. Oh. Well, you should I'm just crackers know. about cheese. Cheese. it. I got it right. You got it right. I'm so thrilled. N now you're going to go on a big run of form and never get one wrong again. Foreman? What? <laughs> I'm going to... What did he say? A I'm big gonna... run of form. Oh, a big run of right, yeah, form? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then I followed oh, it with said... and. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mum, go on, big run of form. I'm on a big run of foreman. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Okay. George Foreman. George Foreman. Um, Who's George Foreman? The Foreman Grill. That's the one. I was thinking of George Formby, who played the ukulele. That's different. Make sure we post that clip. Yeah. Right. You'd like um, that. Yeah. Yeah, go on then. Mum, can we talk? Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Not that we've done enough of that Do already. It. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. Um, let's dive right in. Oh, we've got voice notes. Oh, marvellous. From Henrietta. Oh, lovely. I feel like we've had, have we had Henrietta before? Don't think so. Um, oh, no, of course. Um, she what? was on it, but then Henrietta. <laughs> No one? Oh. No, see, that's a dad joke. Yeah. That is exactly what dad mm. would have said. Right, voice note from Henrietta. Yes. So, basically, when I was at school, I was going out with this boy, and it ended ages and ages and ages ago. But I keep dreaming about him, and now I'm really freaked out. What do I do? Have you ever dreamed about old... I'd say love. I don't know if it was a love, but, well, clearly, apparently it is, but whatevs. Oh. <laughs> wow. Oh, I dream about old people all the time. Oh, no, not old people. <laughs> old, you know, things all the time. Really? That, yes. Dreams always have meaning, you know, Mum. Well, yeah, but... Um, You're not in love with Dad, are you? I'm so in love with Dad. God. Who are these old flames? I'd be fuming. No, but not necessarily, no. No, no, no. maybe I... I should go back. I, but, yeah, I think you always do dream about old loves and no I don't don't you no I don't really ever remember my dreams oh don't you no oh I love remembering a good dream I rarely remember my dreams love it when you wake up such and you're are not the sure. terrors of the night oh stop it demons S stop chase it chase me in the wilderness oh dear here we go weirdo hooded men in shadows oh dear are you alright Arthur sorry um Henrietta Oh, she says it ended a long time ago. Mm. So actually, I suppose that is a bit odd. Maybe I will. I, look, I would. I would take it as a slight sign. I mean, I how do you feel within? How do you feel in your waking state? Do you like him still in your normal day-to-day -day life? Do you see him? If you're not seeing him and you're still dreaming about him, yeah, then that probably that's is quite a bit weird. Strange. Not weird, but a sign. Mm. Just seeing him every day and then dreaming about him. Maybe. Yeah. No, that's true. Um, but yeah. Or just, yeah, take more sleeping pills and don't remember your dreams. No, don't say oh, that. Oh, sorry. No. No. Oh, God, I don't think we've been very good on this one. We're not. Well, um, and I don't think I should can, have said that AI I dreamt about response. past lovers. Because I don't think that's quite true. I think what I meant to say was... <laughs> <laughs> There's no point in backtracking, is there? I don't really dream about... He talks about you in his sleep. <laughs> There's nothing I can do to keep from crying. When he called your name, name. Henrietta. Henry. No, it's not Henriette. Oh, it is Henriette. No, that was the last one. No, what is what this last the one? one? This is the first one. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Dear oh, God, me. I have actually lost it completely. I think you have. Have we not had another one already? No. We haven't? We haven't. That was question one that from Henrietta. That was question one from Henrietta, and it was a voice note about dreams. Yes. You're in one right now. I think I am. Wake up. Well, hey. Oh, Henrietta. Yeah, Henrietta, sorry about this. I'm sorry. We're going to say, yeah, just trust your heart. That's always safe bet, isn't it? 
<laughs> trust if you if you're still dreaming about him, maybe it's a sign. Maybe t- yeah. It depends what he did. Oh yes, it does. There's yeah, a complex yeah, situation yeah. here. Mm. And frankly, we're not qualified. No, we're not. Um, okay. We've got another voice note, so headphones oh, on, headphones please. Oh, headphones on again. Oh, my Shut goodness. up for a second. You're right. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to concentrate. Right. This one is from Alyssa. Ali- Alicia. Alicia. Uh, Ali- well, how's it spelt? A L Y S S A. Alyssa. Alyssa. Yes. Hi, Arthur, and lovely Lisa. I'm outside right now. I'm sorry if you can hear that. But I have two questions, which I think are actually quite deep. Um, and I don't mean them to be. But first of all, I'm 17, I'm turning 18 at the end of this year, and I'm terrified of becoming an adult. Um, what advice would you give to someone who, you know, is like me and is terrified of becoming an adult and getting older and no longer being a baby and having to do things in this big, scary world? Um, and also, specifically for Arthur, what advice do you give to boys and stuff? Well, pfft, well pfft, that doesn't sound right. But um, men, maybe, who aren't as in touch with their feminine side but want to be. Uh, I know a lot of boys who would probably benefit from being more in touch with their feminine side. So, yeah. Right. Oh, gosh. What did she say right at the beginning? I'm outside right now. Yeah. 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 What, like here? (laughs) I don't understand. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, Who did she be? She was just outside. <laughs> I thought she meant she was outside the door. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> she was outside. Yeah. I really thought that meant that any minute now she was going to come in. Yeah, that would have been good. <laughs> oh, dear God. Right. What's her name? Alyssa, Alyssa, Alyssa. Um, she's oh. not coming in. She's, she's not, not coming, coming in. in. Oh, Alyssa, um, I but she expecting... is coming of age. She's very good, Arthur. And it's a serious. She asked a serious question. Uh, yeah, so she did. Laughing. I know. I'm so sorry. She <laughs> sounded really sensible, though. She did. She did. So she I think really you're worrying over nothing. Look, yeah. I am 25, and I'm still rubbish at being an adult, and I've That's made it true. this far. So it's not as scary as you think. It's just you know to jump to 17 to 18 is just a numerical one um i don't know what life changes you're making but i think you'll tackle them head on and do well at them oh well said you sound Arthur. like you've got a good pair of head a good pair of head on pair your pair shoulders heads on your shoulder <laughs> he's got she's a got good, a good head yeah. on her shoulders yes one has shoulders and yes. one head which brings us on to the sponsor of this episode head and shoulders <laughs> um <laughs> no <laughs> oh. Yes. Yes. No, I think you're right. yes, I think you're yeah. absolutely right. But what about the feminine bit? The feminine bit. Um I I mean I I don't really it's a tough question I've, that I've not been asked before, but I would say um you're asking the fucking wrong bloke. Oh. <laughs> Thank I don't know what you, you're Arthur. on about, love. No, he's No, joking. um I would say I think a good way to start is just through clothing. Oh, um, okay. If they're wanting to get a bit more feminine, you know, hmm. most of the shirt t-shirts I wear are women's t-shirts. Are they? Um, makes you just feel a bit more feminine. Um, oh. But I think, how do you get more in touch? With, hang out with hang out with more girls platonically. Yes. It's, I, I much probably prefer hanging out with girls than I do guys. There's less pressure to it, I think, in my opinion. And you understand the other side. Oh wait, she's a girl. Yeah, um, like nice. I just heard about periods. Crazy. Did you die? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah. Who, who were you discussing that with? Um, well, no, you don't have Florence to. Florence Nightingale. Really? Yes, I think she's quite dead. Yeah. Um, I was a, it was a dream. <laughs> um, oh, but a dream. yes, the, the um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm I'm just naturally feminine, babe. I don't know. You're not. No. I think it, it... No, we've had this conversation yeah, so many have. times. I think it's about hanging around with the right people. Yeah. I think, you know, steer away from those sort of blokey blokes that... Toxic blokey blokes. Get rid of them. That, you know, mm-hmm. are a bit... Um, what's the word? Aggressive and misogynistic and all that sort of thing. And just try and, you know... Precisely. Steer yourself towards... 
nicer, gentler types. Well like said. Like Arthur. Like me. Yes. Yes. But don't worry about becoming 18. No. It's literally, it's just another day. Isn't it? fine. It's a bit like me becoming 60. It's no big deal. Like, yeah, I forgot to do my washing all week. Did you? And then I was pantsless. Oh. And I'm 25. Hopeless. Yeah. I'm not wearing any now. Didn't need to know that. Didn't want to know that. Mm. I am. Two pairs, actually. Two pairs. Yeah. They don't call um, you two pants Arthur for nothing. Nobody calls me that, idiot. They do now. Right. What? Moving on. Oh, good. Question three. Is it? From Tilly. Right. That's Hi a nice name. It is a nice name. Hmm. Um, hi, Arthur and Lisa. Hello. Wish this could be anonymous even for you, but here we go. Oh, eh? It can be. Well, too late now. Um, on a very hungover <laughs> Sunday last year, I woke up at my then boyfriend's house. I went downstairs to go to the toilet and his dad was having an unnecessarily long Sunday self-care bath. Oh. I waited about 20 minutes while the urge to shit grew stronger and stronger to the point where I couldn't hold it anymore. So I went to the garden, shat on a massive leaf, oh, then God. chucked it in the hedge. Where's the strangest place you've ever defecated? Oh, stop asking such ridiculous questions. Honestly. Tilly? Tilly. Uh, well, I've never done such a thing. You must have had I it. haven't. At some point in your life. Never. There must have been a woodland poo at least. Never. Not once? No. Never. That's crazy. I am just really weird about that kind of thing. I've done a woodland poo before. Have you? Mm. Oh, yeah. I Did you have to use a leaf? Yes, I used a leaf. Um, I'd be very nervous about using a leaf in case it was an spiky or... I did use a stinging nettle. One. Oh, don't be ridiculous. But that was on purpose. That's ridiculous. I'd heard it was pleasurable. Don't be silly. At least she did it with a, onto a leaf, she says. Very true. In your own garden, you know, it's not too bad. It's not her garden. She was oh. in her boyfriend's oh, garden. Oh, she was, yes. How well, did, oh, I, yeah. I, I forgot about that. that. Chucked it in the head. Oh, she sat on a massive leaf. Yes. She didn't use the leaf to wipe. Well, we don't know Did that. she wipe? I don't care. Many questions... No, there aren't. Mm. Stop it, Tilly. Stop it. Stop it. I'm trying to think. No, stop no. thinking. Move on. Well, Enough the already. moving on is goodbye. Well, excellent. And I just want to linger on the <laughs> shit for a bit longer. I don't want to linger okay. on. Okay. Did you and have can, to can't let we it say linger? Poo instead? I hate poo. the word poop. Yes. I love poop. No poop. Can we bring back poop? I was just pooping. So much. Well, it sounds kind of sweeter, poop. doesn't it? Poop. Oh, this is actually what we can. I still haven't fixed the underfloor heating in my in, your in my toilet, in my in my bathroom. In your bathroom. So okay. you can imagine our, the the, the oh, weekend weather. Was very my warm. shits in there like I'm shitting in the depths Thank of you. hell. Stop it! My feet burn as my ass does. Yes, very funny. It's like it, I, I, <sighs> it, I'm sweating. It needs to be fixed. Well, you need to fix it. And next time you go in, or when you're on toilet, put a towel down. So no, but it's the heat of the room. It, well, yeah. I've done it twice this week. So obviously something is going on what? a bit funny with my brain. Twice this week, I've gone to go for a wee and I've forgotten to lift up the lid and I've sat down and gone, oops. <laughs> what, well, started to, weeing? No, I didn't oh. get as far as starting because the minute you sit down and it oh, feels a bit cold yeah. and full mm. and you're like, oh, yeah. But that's weird, isn't it? That is weird. Oh. oh, could be old age. Could, could be. be time for a home soon. No, don't know. no, don't, don't be know. ridiculous, Arthur. Those bright colours aren't going to save your brain. <laughs> mm, that's true. But goodbye. Oh, bye. Bye. Oh, is it really time? It to is go? time to go. Actually, I'm quite glad. Me too. Fucking hell. Always remember. Listen and watch new episodes every Wednesday. And if you're in need of advice or even just have a question or story Stop that, that you are desperate for my mum to read, slide into the DMs on socials at Mummy's Boy Pod or give me a message on WhatsApp on 07822 013 837. Yes! <laughs> 
And no matter what the issue, I will ask her. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. It's mommy's boy.